Well, here we are back. Let's do a new character. I think I'm gonna try to change some things around. I wanna, I wanna do some more X stuff. I like hitting people with axes. And quote me on that. Um, so yeah, let's take a look. Let's do this. I think 18. Don't need any more intelligence than 18, I think. I can also go with 16, let's see. 16 here. Let's do... 18 agility. Maybe. 16 agility, that we don't have a... Minus thing here. And put that into... I don't know. Strength? Let's do that. And we, why not? Whatever. <laughs> I, I have no idea what I'm doing. So, we're gonna get some stuff. So, I'm going to play the Chimera again. I think I'm not gonna go with regeneration now. That is kind of fun to use. But, uh... I don't know if we actually need it. So, I mean, that might... I don't know. I think I'm I'm gonna try some stuff without regeneration. So, uh, I mean, I could go with just one of these here yeah, again. Just to have some more attack power, I guess. Is there anything two-headed? No. Two-hearted. Gives us higher toughness. Lower quickness. I don't actually know if you can increase this uh, mutation to further increase your toughness. That would be kind of nice. I don't know. I'm gonna try that. You know what? I think I'm gonna go with uh, freezing hands for now. Because um, with that we can also slow our enemies down, which would be kind of nice. And to freeze them. Um, but... Going with two-hearted might actually be a cool thing as well. So, I'm going to try that out at some point. What are the physical defects, actually? Let's see. Albino amphibious analgesia was a developed sense of pain. Yeah. And we could get that and then get two-hearted, actually. And that would work, you know. And we don't really... Like, this is not actually terrible to have. You can only have one defect, actually. I didn't... I didn't know that. Interesting. Are there more now? Ravenous? Oh yeah, that's food. Books for feet. <laughs> I cannot wear shoes, yeah. Hemophilia. Much longer than usual for you to stop bleeding. That's bad, yeah. Brittle bones? Mm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> Let's go with Analgesia. Let's have two hearted, freezing hands, and carapace. I guess. Right? Let's go. I don't know. Um, I th we're gonna go with the Marauder again, because I want some axe action. And our name is... Medi Mediocre Man. Okay, I'm in search of work, and I'm also in search of vine wafers. Well, let's get those. Doop de doop de doop de doop. Alright, let's give him our furs. And a bunch of our, no, not so many torches, but a bunch of them. Yeah, like this. Yeah, that works. Trade complete. Okay, so you are gonna give me that quest, aren't you? Good. You are gonna give me your hundred vine wafers as well. You can have some torches for that. Like this. Oh, no, 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 no. I pressed the auto explore thing. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at this. Wooden arrows and water skin. Well, that's not. That's not exactly what I would call a haul, but, uh. Well. Oh, that's a weird artifact. It's a freeze grenade. That's good. That. Oh, hello, buddy. He opened the door. I think he's not actually. He's not part of the Joppa citizen group, so. Won't have a problem with that. Um, on our head, we're going to wear the Norworm skull, because that increases our ego as well. 
not just our armor value, like the leather cap. And let's take a look at that chest. Another weird artifact. Six, it's an electro bow. Jesus Christ, that's good. Uh, yeah, we're gonna get that. I don't think I'm gonna actually um, sell that to... I don't think I'm gonna... Not sell that, but I don't think I'm gonna give that to Argive, because that would be crazy. Um, I'm gonna keep the iron buckler. Sell this. Sell those. Nylon body pack. Armor, we don't can't use any of those. Yeah, there is not really much to get here. Um, can we get rid of anything more? Yeah, the leather cap. Sure. All right, that works for me. So we're gonna equip. Da, 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 da. On the left arm, we're gonna equip the arm buckler. Oh, I don't have night vision. I should not have s sold all my torches. Oh dear me! <laughs> I'm a, I'm an I'm an idiot. I'm a total idiot. I did not get night vision. <laughs> well, good, good on me. So we can now go and buy back a lot of torches. For way too much money. I'm stupid, but we have to. I have to do that now. I think I can't actually. You no. Know? Um, let's see. Let's take the trinket out of this. How? Yeah, we can still sell that. <sighs> I am stupid. For an electro bow. <laughs> Good deal. Alright, so let's go to this guy. Uh, let's give him this. And you know what? I'm just gonna give him the cell. Well. Fantastic. By the vine wafers now. <laughs> uh, you know, sometimes sometimes. Okay, so we're gonna put freezing hands on one. Yes. I'm gonna put charge on two. Dismember is already, yeah. And Titan Carapace on four. And sprint on five. How about that? Okay. So, uh, everything is bad, everything is terrible, that is good. Let's take a look at this thing. It's um, to the ancient Sultan Orochir. Let's cover the location of Kibawa, Kibawa, uh, we have the quest to visit it. So I guess this is going to be it then, right? Like this thing, do you see my mouse cursor? Yes. <laughs> like this, I think that is the specific things. That's cool. And it's also pretty close, so uh, we might actually go there, I guess after Red Rock, or after we've done some stuff to get the start here. You know? It might be a good idea. Let's try this. Oh! Legendary human child. What crazy stuff is going on here? Um, hello. Who are you? It's a hunter. Can I talk to you? Uh, he speaks something that I don't understand. There's a killer croc over there. Hey! Oh, he got killed by the guy. I can get the meat! Hunters, and there's some legendary child. Human child! A mushroom. This is crazy. Harum parum. Yeah, good. Um, those are just human childs. Children. Human childs. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, mm hmm. Also, I did not spend my mutation point. Yeah, we can actually increase two hearted. Good. Alright, so we have some stuff to do. I'm gonna go with Carapace first, just to increase our armor value a bit. And uh, let's have a bit of a look around here, shall we? Murder those glow pads. Who are you? Worshipper of something. 
I don't know what all this nonsense is about here, but, uh, you know? There's some new stuff in the game, and I like it. I like it. And what do we have? Oh, yeah, there's another shrine here, actually. It's another shrine to Orashia Telescope Dancer. Okay. Ancient Sultan Orashia. Yeah, that has something to do with that. The Gilded Scepter. Weird. Okay, we can go down here as well. What's going on here? These are just bones, okay. Hmm. What the hell are you guys doing here? We've not yet found that legendary child, didn't we? The legendary human child. My human son. Um, yeah, whatever. Let's take out these things. Do some hand freezing on the way. I think we're actually close to the next level up, so... Just a few more glow pads and we're done. One more. We have another glow pad around. Also, I need to remind myself to extinguish those torches. Because, um... Yeah. Oops, croc. Let's freeze the croc. Punch the croc. Kill the croc. So, skill points, yeah, indeed. So we're gonna put that point into strength for now. And... I know I have 22... Oh yeah, two-hearted, of course. Totally forgot about that. Let's put that into freezing hands for now. And we're gonna get some points into... I'm gonna wait a bit to get cleave. Yes, I will. Alright. So let's pick up the meat and let's just take out these things. Oh, I'm injured. Oh yeah, I'm wounded now. I need to... hmm. The Anagesia is actually more of a problem here because uh, you can't actually see it on the, on the, on the bar. Oh, cool stuff. Okay, let's take out these fish. They're easy to kill, and give you the same amount of experience. Yes, they do. Okay, what's going on with my voice here? It's just doing weird stuff. <clears throat> Injured. Let's rest up, and we're perfect again. I'm perfect. No matter what they say. Okay, so, um, yeah, I'm just gonna take out a bunch of this stuff here. We need to, we need to get a few levels going before we do much more. That's just kind of important. Because, uh, you know, things are tough. Okay. Yeah, good, 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 good. Let's keep going. I'm going to charge that fish. Oh. Not more than three squares, but at least two. Jesus, that is restrictive. Okay, now the fish are all angry. No. Everything is iced. Oops, and now we need to actually... Oh, yeah. We need to actually equip the torch again. Oh, I'm so stupid. Selling those torches. You were probably screaming at me while I was doing that, right? And, uh, you were pretty justified in doing so. Well, um, okay, there's some stuff here. I'm actually kind of scared of the planes, so I might just go towards Red Rock. I'm just gonna pick up a bunch of stuff here. Sell it. Because, um, yeah, what I'm gonna do is a thing that I've talked about in one of the last runs as well is to, uh, yeah, we're gonna deposit a chest in Joppa. We're gonna use that to store some stuff, including, you know, fresh water, for example, and um, 
stuff like copper nuggets and so on, I guess. Oh fuck. Hey you. Hey you. Get frozen. Where are you? Oh no. Get frozen, I said. Yeah, the freezing hands is actually not bad for stuff like this. Because you can really slow them down. Flaming hands might do more damage with, uh, you know, it has a higher damage roll. I think it has a d6 and this has a d4 damage. But, and also flaming hands has the, you know, the actual flaming, I guess. But, uh, yeah, the slowing down is actually really good. I'm gonna put that into, yeah, I'm gonna put that into freezing hands. I'm gonna get that pretty high to do some proper damage. Like that's sturdy. Hmm. That was my pawn name. And I didn't penetrate. Ha <laughs> hey! Sorry. I'm, uh, I'm really sorry. Oh. Dear me. Okay. Oh, Christ. Uh, for some reason I have actually now targeted the, the kudzu over there. So, that's not... Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can find the entrance. I'm gonna have a good going rummaging around the plains later, I guess. But for now, I think I'm just gonna do this real... Oh, fuck me, there's... Oh, Jesus. This is unfortunate. Okay. At least we have the freezing hands, which is a bit of a relief. Ah, I think we might actually be able to take care of this. Okay. Three more turns, because we can always run. Perfect, fine, almost fine, killed. Okay. Worms, urchins, and the Gersh. Hmm. Basic toolkit. Uh, I think I'm just gonna get all of this nonsense. Hey, I'm gonna freeze you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm also gonna kill that goat, because we have butchery. We can butcher that thing. And get some raw goat meat out of it. And, uh, yeah, beat a bracelet. That is good. Desert crease. Is the equivalent of an iron dagger. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Alright. Well, that is. Well, that is sort of an eventful run, isn't it? There's some. There's some stuff going on. Okay, that's a brute. Yeah, the, the freezing hands are actually quite cool. I, I like that. I like that. Iron longsword, we're gonna pick that up. Also, I need to remind myself that if I find a chest, I need to pick it up. It's not even heavy. I thought they were like 20 pounds or something, but uh, they're actually not. They are... One pound, I think. It's a one pound chest. Looks like a pretty flimsy chest to me, but... Uh, you know, well, it seems to be fine, so who am I to complain? Cloth robe, bronze battle axe. Yeah, I'm still not really used to monitoring the, the message window. Window. Message window map mare. The message window up there. Because, uh, yeah, <laughs> I, I don't know. I think I'm pretty... pick up this thing. You know, I'm a pretty habitual per person. Jesus Christ, talking, Persian. <laughs> Kill to troll, no. Who's that guy? Another moccasin. We still have something on our feet? No, we don't. Well, let's just equip that, I guess. Not much more going on here. Okay. 
There's a young ivory. I don't like young ivories. Can we actually destroy them with the freezing hands? Probably not, right? Nope. Hmm, but apparently they, uh, if they are frozen, they don't... Oh, yeah, you're still stuck. Okay. We are, uh, we are plenty stuck. Okay. Oh, no. One of these guys. These are actually dangerous now. For now. Which is um, kind of new for me. Because, <laughs> you know, with all the builds I've been playing so far, that wasn't actually the case. But now it is. And it's fine, you know. Also, we have a dodge value of minus three. Mostly caused by that iron buckler. That we can't actually really make use of because we don't have a shield skill. We need to. And we also have 222 points. Man, I'm so scatterbrained today. Okay, let's get cleave. And let's just get a bunch of axe stuff going. Iron battle axe, I want that. Equip auto. Yes, iron battle axe. Fantastic. Whoopsie, yes, kill you. Iron short sword, leather moccasins, engraved iron mace. Um, that was, is again with the story or something, isn't it? Yes. Seen from the life of the ancient sultan Yule Med too. So this is some sort of, um... I kind of like this, actually. This is sort of procedurally generated ancient history. And I'm, I'm a fan of that. Let's go down. We need to be really careful once we... I don't actually know if I'm going to take the waterway path. Or... Oh, bollocks. Hey, man. I'm cool. I'm burning. Can I freeze myself? No. Well, that's not... We don't need to try. <clears throat> I mean, I could probably freeze myself, but I don't know if that would be such a good idea, you know. Um... Mm-hmm. Gained a level. Good. So, we're gonna put that into Carapace. Yes. We're gonna do some uh, two-hearted. We're gonna increase our two-heartedness as well. I think I might actually hmm, might actually be a good idea to do that earlier because uh, having higher toughness affects you know how much health you get upon oops why do we have it? And then iron longsword, yes there was. How much health you get upon level up. And that means this actually has a permanent impact. So getting toughness up pretty soon is actually a good idea. I think I broke it, fuck me. I wonder if we can still get that to Argive. That was just a grenade, you know? Oh, did I pick up the box, actually? Did I already pick up a box? I think I didn't. Nope, I didn't. Let's take the chest. Okay. Hmm, I'm wounded. Not a fan of that, let's rest up. Why do I have... I equipped the engraved iron maze. For some godforsaken reason. I'm, uh... I don't even know. Man, oh man. Okay. Also, I'm not using my dismember stuff and so on. I need to... You know? Like, kids don't play Caves of Card on a scatterbrained day. Let me tell you. It's just not working out all that well. Boskin gloves. Oh, yeah, we can't do that because, um. Mm, we have freezing hands. Can't put gloves atop of the freeze. Because that would just, uh. not go well, I guess. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We actually already found the stairs down. No, we didn't. Interesting. Oh, there they are. Well, okay. Let's go down. All right. And now we already know where the stairs down are. That's good. Club. 
on battle axe. Well, good. Um, let's kill these guys. And now, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to end the video. Let's get the weird artifact. It's just a grenade, so no need to bother trying to identify it. And uh, yeah, that's gonna go to Argo. Oh, we are. We already gave Argive all the stuff. Jesus. Brain. I don't know. I'm... You know, I think I need to go lie down a bit. And, uh, yeah, hope to see you again next time. See ya!